Hi, my name is Scott Haynes. Uh, I'm a student here at the Oregon Institute of Technology. Uh, my role in this project is that I'm one of the lead designers and fabricators, and we're hoping to show you what we got and that we can make it to the competition. Thanks. My name is Willie Reen. I am a senior at Oregon Tech's Mechanical Engineering Department. I wanted to do this Red Bull competition because I thought it was a unique way to test what I have learned. And I'm going to be doing most of the coding for the Arduino. The key element to our project is the Rubens tube, also known as the fire tube. We tried with several different variations, from 3 inch diameters to quarter inch diameters. And we had to do different distances apart for the hole spacing. In the end, we decided on one and a half inch diameter pipe with about one inch spacing for the holes. My name is Preston Gilbert. I'm a manufacturing engineer at Oregon Tech. My background is that I transferred from Salem as a machinist, and my role in the team is team leader, so everyone has to do what I say. The first thing we had to do was put a subwoofer on our tube. Our subwoofer has one of the holes on the base covered, so that it amplifies the air pressure in the tube. Um, the tube is covered with reflective tape to reflect the radiation from the fire. Hi, my name is Alex Adamsev. I am an OIT student. I'm a manufacturing engineering technology master's. Uh, I want to do the project because it involves programming and I'm good at that. The first step is to test your tube. Make sure your holes are spaced tight enough that they light by themselves and make sure the bladder is working or else you will have an accident. My name is Sam Elliott. I'm a mechanical and manufacturing engineer at the Oregon Institute of Technology. My job on the Red Bull team is to be uh, in charge of pyrotechnics due to my past years of fire suppression. Also, I'm in charge of logistics for the ice fountain. We have the LEDs hooked up to blink with the music and to run red lights down the waterfall. The music is synced up using a program called Processing and it will blink with the music. And last, here is the infamous turbo encabulator. We're Oregon Tech Mech, and that's how you rock the Turbo and Cavalier.